In the following series of lectures, uh, videos, we will be learning about timber design and we will be following the code books uh, for doing timber design that are created by the American Wood Council. And there are several documents that they have created that we will be referring to often. The one that we will refer to here is called the NDS, the National Design Specification. It contains a lot of the code information uh, regarding formulas and explanations about how the wood design procedure is to be carried out for various wood members. We will also refer to the supplement. This is another document that uh, refers to things like uh, the section properties of the various sizes of sawn lumber and glue lamb beams. It also has uh, the properties in terms of table values of stresses that can be used to then create your allowable stresses. It also has some tables regarding um, uh, adjustment factors for stresses, which we'll learn about in later videos. And uh, so for sawn lumber uh, and also for glue lamb beams, we can find um, uh, stress information in the tables. And um, uh, this is where you would look that up. It also in those tables has, of course, uh, all kinds of different species of wood that can be used for construction. The species of wood that we will use uh, throughout our course, though, is Douglas fir larch, which is most common on the western states. The third document that we will look at in later videos briefly is this SDPWS document. And really, we will only use this document to look at some tables that relate to the design of roof diaphragms using plywood or for the design of shear walls using plywood. And with that, I'll conclude this video. And just remember that uh, these are the three documents that we'll be referring to. And uh, you can look at these when uh, you need to.